All right, John. So first you get a spaceship, right? Okay. You get a spaceship, and then you're gonna put like a black T-shirt with like a Hello Kitty on it, and like okay. some black eyeliner, or and then the like a yeah, yeah. Final Fantasy VII kind of emo haircut, right? That's yeah. and then you're yeah. gonna be a Gothic Armada. That's yeah. what it is, right? Yeah, no, that that's, sounds about right. That's what this game is. Also, like, really like Johnny the Homicidal Maniac. Yeah, and, yeah, 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 yeah. The I'm Crow. Like so into the Cure, man. There's my yeah, favorite. Yeah. <laughs> well, hello, everybody, and welcome to the Dojo here on Rage Select. I am Jeff. I'm John. And now that we've made all four of our goth listeners, are th- is that still a thing? Are people still goth? I don't know. Hot Topic's still a thing. That is, that is, in spite of the fact that that uh, the catchiest song of all time exists, and that is "Burn Down the Hot Topic." But no, this is Battlefleet Gothic Armada. Um, a, 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 like this is Warhammer 40k, but we don't ever get to see this part of Warhammer 40k. Ooh, Imperium of Man. Yeah. The worlds of man are scattered across the galaxy, threatened by savage aliens. Destroy the Xenos. Burn the, burn the unbelievers. And fuck the Eldar and the Tau, especially the Necrons, though. Ooh, the Eye of Terror. I don't understand any of your crazy moon language, Jeff. <laughs> You're not a Warhammer 40k fan? No, I don't play. War- I'm not, you know, I've never really played it, so. Oh, 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 look, this is Chaos Bastards. This is the Uh-oh. perfect time for me to piss on everybody who likes chaos. Fuck chaos. Chaos is for garbage people. Yeah, chaos is for dorks. That's Horus. He's a dork. He's the dorkest of all dorks. Okay. So do you? I mean, do you know like the basics of Warhammer? No. Okay. So like, it's like I mean, wouldn't Warhammer just like orcs in space? Sort of. It's like it's what? It's the year forty thousand or something, and like, uh, like all of mankind. Like you've got the space marines, right? Yeah. And they're like. Like super war clones that are like eight feet tall, and they got chainsaw guns and shit. But then, like, yeah. there's another dimension that's full of all this chaos, and chaos is like this corrupting influence. But they use the warp to like move around the universe, and so every so often somebody will get like infected with the warp, and it'll turn them all into chaos assholes. And then you got aliens like the Tau, who are a bunch of r- robot-looking kind of guys. And then you got the Eldar that are space elves. And then you got the Necrons that are filthy, fucking cheating. They're undead robots. How can a robot be undead? Fuck you. I feel dumber having heard all of that. Yes. See, listen to these guys. They're the gothic ones. They're like the emo, space emos. Listening to, you know, Linkin Park. Yeah. Yeah, he looks like he likes some Linkin Park. Horus was the emperor's son, and and then he got corrupted by chaos, and then he, like, overthrew the emperor or something, and then there's, like, a big, and everything's in war. And chaos and war and war and a hammer. There's also a hammer in there somewhere. There's a hammer. Okay. There's a, yeah. There's always at least one hammer. Captain Spire, data log alpha. All right. Well, this is. Command has lost contact with orbital station Aleph in the Naxos system. I'm on my way to investigate. All right, let's do it. All right. We're approaching the location of orbital station Aleph. Yeah. Captain, the station is surrounded by an asteroid field. I have calculated the best approach for us to pass through. So anyway, All right. <coughs> um, most of Warhammer 40K, John, is like, you you, you know that, yeah, right? Yeah, it's like you, ground forces. Yeah, you like do that. But then fighting. this is, there's like, there's this. There was this. also that chess game. Yeah, 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 that we played. Um, but this is like, there's apparently a whole bunch of Warhammer that's just space. Yeah. Where they've guys, they've got like these giant, like you can see, they're like these big cathedral ships that all have like this nifty looking like uh, architecture. Like they got big churches on top of them and shit like that. Yeah. And they run around, they blow each other up, and that's what this game is. And I'm like, great, because I've been sending Terminators to kill hundreds of orcs for far too long. So, um, all right, so let's go. Understood. Let's go moving around. So yeah, I've actually been looking forward to this. It's funny, I saw a trailer for it a while back. And um, there's an active minefield directly ahead, Captain. That's like a mine chandelier. Yeah, what the? F- the ship will be damaged. I don't want it. Ship available power to the plasma thrusters. We're going to execute a high energy turn. Let's see if high I can- energy turn. All right, let's make our energy high. Oh, my energy's so high, man. It's 420. Oh. oh. Dude, did we just Tokyo drift that battle cruiser? We just drifted <laughs> that <laughs> battle cruiser. <laughs> Man, <laughs> is this my is this my is this my drift uh, juice? Is this my nos, nice. my space nos? 
Um, so, yeah, all right. So, let's see. Asteroid fields are dangerous. Damage dealt. Go to so, anyway, like a few uh, like a few months back, the first uh, the first trailer for this came out, and it was it's being, like, published by Focus Interactive that does, like, a lot of, like, Spiders games. And they're, like, okay. I love oh, Focus Interactive because they're, like, the last funky middleware publisher. Uh-oh. What's going on here? To discover what happened here. Did my space church. Oh no! Yeah, what the, the space church? Oh, space Martin see. Luther nailed his space uh, thing. Oh shit! We can reach the station faster. What's all that? The engine status to all ahead full. All ahead full. Ding ding ding. All uh, right, let's go to space church and learn about space Jesus. That's right. Space Jesus is not an orc. I can tell you that right now. Okay. Uh, I do like me some orcs though. Like they're the only other faction in the Warhammer universe that's that a really tiny minefield that I'm down with. Chandelier. Yeah, well, yeah, a little field. mine chandelier. Yeah, I bet the forces of chaos left that because they're a bunch of dorks. It's a random mine chandelier somewhere. But it's like okay, so this is like an RTS that uh, oh, double click on a ship to do the follow camera. Okay, so we can yeah yeah we use all he oops nope 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 nope. nope. But this is like uh, like you build a fleet, and then it's like fleet-on-fleet fleet combat. So it's kind of like an RTS, except that it's all in space, and you oh. don't actually do any like production, right? Okay. Um, it seems like the station has been attacked recently. Does it? Oh, yeah. Look, it's all. Around. They could just be smoking out. Since it's 420, bro. Sorry. <laughs> some of the ships and it's actually 421. I'm sorry. <laughs> the day that they're watching this, it's 422. Yeah. Man, look at all the thrusters on this on this monkey j jabber. Yeah. Look at that thing. Oh shit! Is that the is that the warp over there? Why did you build a church so close to the void, you jerks? All right. So what do we got? Uh, assault actions are okay. So let's see. We know all ahead full. We can get rid of that. Maneuvers consume. Oh, look at the way they man. They spelled the shit out of that word. Maneuvers. Maneuvers. It's like use all the vowels, all of them. Uh, consume combustion gauge, which will replenish over time at cruising speed. Okay, boop. And then assault actions are skills that send troops into enemy ships to cause critical damage. Boarding and lightning strikes are the most common assault actions. Okay, so boarding, board the. Oh, well, do I have gotta to get closer? I have to be like turned to a ninety degree angle. Yeah. Okay. Like you know what this kind of reminds me. Oh shit! God damn it! Uh, a little bit of is um, uh, what was that? Um, oh fuck! How did I do that? Uh, At your command. Um, what was that space western thing? It was like kind of like Privateer. Came out on the PS4, oh, or the I PC. Have, I have no idea. Joe and I played it. God damn! What the fuck was the name of that? Oh yeah, no, I know what you're talking about. I don't remember the title. I just it. I remember there's a whole thing in that where it's like you were doing broadside attacks, yeah. right? Oh no! Oh no! I have a bad feeling about this. Well, then now you're dead, because <laughs> yeah. it's a trap. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is a trap. Oh, no. That oh. black bar is coming. <laughs> Captain, a defense platform on the station has activated and is targeting our vessel. Man, look at that guy. Broadside oh, shit. Macro cannons ready to fire fire the broadside macros. Uh, 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 attack. Enemy vessel. Bam. Just fuck your turrets. Go to hell. Uh, I right-clicked on a thing, John. Yeah, you did. Given an order, right-click on a button on an enemy ship. Okay, shields, when the shields are will absorb until they're done, and then they'll be blowed up. So, uh, yeah, keep ready. keep attacking. Um, but, yeah, one of the things that I kind of like about the Warhammer universe, it's a little funky, is the, um, like, they're always, the, the Imperium of Man is always so, like, they're always so paranoid about there being any, like, chaotic influence that they have all these, like, uh, like inquisitors and shit like that. So they've got kind of a real weird, like kind of paranoid uh, yeah. thing going on. Yeah. Them. They also they don't have any problem with like wiring up a dead so dude's head to a computer, as you yeah. can see. Yeah. In the nearby gas cloud. Uh oh. So oh shit. Move. Iconoclast destroyers. Ah, kill them. Chaos ships. This sector is a long way from the Eye of Terror. Move. Uh oh. Whatever their reasons, Captain. Maybe they came there for Jesus. <laughs> it was a church after all. Space Jesus. Yeah. can help guide you in making tactical decisions in battle. I will let the Okay, wait, hold on. What the fuck? Okay. Uh tactical Oh shit. Okay. My tactical cogitator. I'm cogitating the tactics. Let's see. Okay, armor efficiency. Armor values are indicated by the stat panel of your ship. It indicates the percentage chance of 
Oh, so it just allows you to slow down the uh, yeah, conjugator. Yeah. Just allows you to slow down. Uh, weapon, every weapon has a specific fire arc. Master Gunner, we need to direct additional power. Tactical to allows you to slow down the speed. Okay. Accuracy. So, oh, what do we need to do? What is this? Lock out. Lock on. Lock on. Allows you ship to focus fire and add resources to targeting. Critical chances are augmented by 100% using a special order. Activates a cooldown on all of them. Well, I already blew up that one ship, right? No. Well, he's almost blowed up. He's close to blowed up. Uh, uh. Why does the conjugator like put all this weird uh, like soap or whatever on I my think screen? You just are hurting his shields. No, oh, am I? Okay, well then let's let's lock on and see what that does. Lock on. Target. Oh, look what happened. Yeah, you just took out his shields. Ah, you shields are down. Ramming speed. Actually, that's a thing. You know, this thing has a giant like cow catcher yeah. on the front of it. You can totally ram other ships. Damn it. We're getting messed up, John. Yeah, you are. These dumb chaos guys. Oh, 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 shit. Oh, shit. Uh oh. Here well, you go. I'm just gonna Almost got him. No, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. You can blow him up. Oh, the purple is when the shields are recharging. Yeah. I got you now. All right. Ha ha. Let's turn. Turn fast. And. New vector. Lock on this motherfucker. Okay, I can't really do much of anything else. I mean, I could maybe try to get close to him and, like, board him, I suppose. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Awaiting orders. Get him. Get him. Smash into him. Get that chaos jerk. Being all dumb and chaotic. Chaosity. You got his shields down. Can I? Oh, uh, we're so close. Here. Can you? Can you? Uh, oh, he's got a fire. Turn. Drift. Drift, monkey. Drift. Hit the drift button. Here, all ahead full. And then let's board him with boarding actions. Oh, wait, shit, I got to turn. Uh, turn. Or I could just run into him, I guess. Yeah, th that would work. Eh, I think that, that worked. Yeah, look at that. Oh, you can turn that off now. You can go back to regular. Ah, shit. I can't blow up that many. There's no way we could survive fighting them head on. That's true. command immediately. Unable to do so, Captain. All communications are jammed. Uh oh. Ah. There may be a way for us to escape and warn Port Moore. Oh, okay. We could risk an emergency warp jump. Oh no. It's risky to engage the warp engines this close to the star's gravitational field. But the Chaos Fleet has us. So that saved. guy, the Commissar. So uh, we don't have any other options. That's like a unit. Uh oh. Oh shit. Uh. Okay. Disengage from the battlefield by using the warp the jump skill. Will guide us out. Oh crap. Do we, do, why do we have to stop while we do this? Oh, eternal God Emperor, preserve us from the dangers of the void. Oh, damn, John. Oh, this is going to be close. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. So, yeah. Oh, there, here we go. There's, like, regular, like, Imperial troops that are just, like, guys. They don't have, like, power armor or anything. And their only advantage is that there's, a, like, a shit ton of them. Yeah. And they do even better when you put a commissar behind them that'll, like, literally, like, Russian armies shoot them if they stop battling. All right, go into the giant space anus. Wee! Victorious! I don't know if running away really counts <laughs> as victory per se, but uh, I'll take it. You know what? Any any uh, battle you can get away from with your life. Yeah. Any any battle where you can go into the giant space anus is a victory in my mind. Uh, all right, what do we got? The Dauntless. We leveled up. So okay, this is why I think that this is really the kind of game. That I'm gonna like a lot, John. Yeah, is because it's the sort of thing where you just like you get a big fleet full of like Imperium dudes, and you're running around. You can do like little side missions, and level up your guys until your fleet is fucking badass. Like that is the kind of game that really, really appeals to me. All right. Um, I like space games, and they just don't make enough of them anymore. And I don't have an Oculus, so I can't play E Valkyrie. Yo, Port Maw, capital of the Gothic sector, headquarters of the battle fleet Gothic. That's too many gothics in one sentence, I'm afraid. Oh, is that Big Ben? Is that Space Big Ben? Whoa, whoa, hey, whoa, whoa. whoa focus. Yeah, oh, there uh, you go. <laughs> That's your company's name for fuck's sake. All right. So... You know what? Isn't there a and d type that is kind of like this? Space Jammer? Star Jammer? Oh, I have no idea. Wind Jammer? There's some if kind of... you say is true. Oh. A vast chaos fleet is massing for a Ah, boo. 
Boo, Mr. Motion Holmes. Comics. Are you sure of this man? Maybe we should consider someone else. Isn't this captain from a planet that rebelled against the Emperor's will? Enough! His faith will be tested. We got Space Marine, Servitor, and Nazgul, Space Nazgul. Love the Emperor, for he is the salvation of mankind. Obey his words, for he will lead you to the light. All right. Oh, are they going to augment him? They're going to make him in like space full space marine or something i guess mate in this particular game he doesn't need to be a space marine right no well, that's weird what all, all of it yeah <laughs> everything you're seeing here yes vice admiral thrawn strapped to a skull chair with like some toilet paper coming off of a floating skull and then there's another skull do you think that the guy in the in the the Rogue One trailer is Vice Admiral Thrawn? I don't know. I saw everybody being like, that's Vice Admiral we Thrawn. I'm like, to be he's a chiss. The enemy we face like, all it takes is blue makeup and some red contact lenses. You are to be promoted to the rank of Admiral and given command of the fleet. Oh, yeah! yeah we'll get a fleet. I will not fail you, Inquisitor. Woo! There is much to do and little time. <laughs> okay, I almost feel like in that particular cutscene, John, it yeah. would have been better to have not moved the guy's mouth. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like well. it looked really weird. But it happened. Yeah, can't take it back. I'm sorry. I hate. I just hate motion comics so much. They always. Oh, whoa, whoa! Beginning to turn away from the Emperor's light. Damn! Treachery, sedition, and heresy have broken out like a plague upon our world. Okay. Oh, wait. Oop. Imperial soldiers have gone rogue and will try to take systems from you. Uh, these traders are not part of any threat, but law systems will give you penalties depending on the ship's type. Nonetheless, each turn, some worlds may become seditious. So we got to go, like, you know. Yeah, keep, keep the peace in addition to uh, Keep them in the, check. Yeah. yeah. So, all right, what do we got here? Can we kind of move around here? Nope. Okay. Uh, Acre, Electris, Portmaw, Lethe, Kiliman, Orko. Oh, wait. Kugahan. What is this? Jeez, guys. Didn't give it like a, a name. Uh, that one right. doesn't have a name either. That's It's Walpurgis. You know. It's got like a gangster, a gangster yeah. name. The assignment is to put an end to the unrest and rebellion threatening a nearby system. Okay. Let's see. 50 if you're victorious. 25 if you're defeated. Wow. 30% uh, of the cost of the destroyed enemy ships. 50% of the cost of the heavily damaged enemy ships. You know, that, that it almost seems like here that these two rewards, John, indicate that you can get into a position where the other side can run from you yeah. and you don't actually fully destroy everybody. Yeah. Set up an ambush for a seditious ship. The enemy is composed of Imperial ships. All right. Fuck, the, fuck those Imperials, I think. Or maybe. This interface helps you prepare your fleet Woo. for the next mission. Okay. The head of every fleet is the flagship. You must select one of your vessels as the flagship for each assignment. Okay. Choose your dauntless light cruiser as the flagship for this first operation. No, okay. This one? That one. You yeah. You have another captain assigned to your command. Okay. This captain commands a dauntless light cruiser and will assist you for the duration of the mission. Add his ship to your fleet. Okay, so I, I feel like this is what, when you play actual Warhammer, that this yeah. is what you do, right? You have yeah. a certain number of points, and then you can divide it between different... Or scout for the enemy. The Firestorm frigates are a good choice for this assignment. Oh, I was going to say, I have 41 points left. That one costs 41 points. Once your fleet is prepared to engage the enemy, you should set course for the target system at once. Okay. All right. Ready. Let's go. I got a fleet. What? Admiral, looks real good, too, right? Yeah, it looks good. Yeah. Oh, dude, what is that? It's a giant space, space rock. It must not stand. How shall we deploy our flagship? With the automatic button. Oh. Okay. Now you must select how you wish to deploy remaining ships of the line. No, all right. Click on them. I mean, there's just like, it's just all a big bar down here. So yeah. like, I mean, you know, like, I don't know. Once your cruisers are deployed, you must next determine where to place the Firestorm escort vessels. Okay. I would assume near your... 
Your new promotion has placed you in command of the entire fleet, Admiral. I think this guy needs like a cough drop or something. Your captains to adopt engagement modes during the battle. Oh wait, okay, so hold on. The start of the mission is deploy. Okay. To place your ships the green. Green deploy. The Firestorm escort ships have powerful prow weapons. Okay. I would advise setting these ships to a frontal attack. Okay. A good understanding of each ship's weapons is the best way to know which engagement mode to use. Okay, wait. You hold, know what? So You're not my mom. Yeah. <laughs> Simply click on the green deployment area to orient them in direction, maintain the click, and then move the mouse in the desired. Okay, so you could turn them. Like if I grab this one, I can like. No. Okay. Never mind. They want me to do this. Okay. This one. Uh, okay. So here's our tactical thing. What is this? Auto engagement. Ship will automatically pick a target, move towards its respecting engagement mode. This says frontal engage. This is broadside engage. Okay. What are these? Short range, medium range, long range. Ah, okay, okay. So he wants to be up close. Then what are these? Ship will engage its target with its closest side. So you can set it directly to starboard. What are these? Hold fire. Focusing target, cancel order. Okay, so everything's done. Let's get the show on the road. All ships coordinate your movements. Damn, we are almost out of time. <laughs> we will advance as one. It's okay. At the same speed. All right, let's advance as one. We will set course for a gas cloud, and use it to ambush the rebel ships. What gas? Okay. Once our ships enter the gas cloud. Can add remove by control clicking. Okay. Um, yes, so Admiral. Create. Groups, one, two, okay, so you can control, one, two, three, okay, so like, Ship ready. all right, that's all of them, all righty, all righty, got all that. Go to a gas cloud. I, is this the gas cloud? No. That I looks think, like an asteroid field. Yeah, I think the gas clouds are the- Is that a gas cloud? Thing. Yeah, Reach yeah. the gas cloud. Gas cloud! All ahead towards gas. Chugga, 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 full speed chugga, ahead. Chugga. Yes, full speed. Full. Oh, shit, we got identified. Sorry. I guess I should have done it, like, easier. Where even is this thing? I'm having a hard time. Okay, that's just, like, background noise. Yeah. I was like, right, I really don't want to run into the giant space rocks. All right. So here we go. Do, 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 do. Let's take a look at our little, uh, do, do, do. this little guy do, here. Do, do, Oop, do, shit. Do, do. He looks pretty cool. He's got that big gun on the front. Oh, hey, hey. Yeah, look at that. I don't know how much I like this, like, hand-drawn look on this thing in the background. Yeah. I don't know. I do not know either. Okay, here we go. Huh. Huh. Orders received. Get to gas cloud. Can I, like, orient? There we go. Underway. Everybody get ready. The gas cloud conceals our fleet, sir. We're invisible to the enemy ships. Okay, hidden from the sight line, hide inside a glass cloud, asteroid field, your ships to stay silent. Uh, at long range, ships are represented by blips. Retro, b maneuver, burn retro in order to stop your ship. Oh, that's what this is. Okay. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Select this ship. So we know this one. Launch the probe. Got this one. Got this one. Probe. You want the probe to go. Bing, the bing, probe bing, bing, bing. Any nearby signals. Okay, so it's kind of also got like it seems like a kind of like a submarine, yeah, kind of a naval warfare feel to it. <clears throat> that makes sense. Between the broadsides and like you know the kind of hiding in the fog and stuff like that. That's cool. I'm still wanting, man. I I oh, wish they would make another. Um, Warhammer 40k Space Marine game. Like, I love that game. Okay. Attack the enemy vessel. All ships. Ready? One, Go. two, three. Attack. Haha, Imperial, -ha, Imperial Navy, bitch. Surprise, motherfucker. Here, let's, uh... Oh, look at this guy. It's like George Washington's on, on the bridge. All right, what's going on? So Admiral Spire, did Ravensburg send you to bring us to Hades? Uh oh, oh. There are other powers in the galaxy besides the Imperium Titan. Uh, which one was is this one? Lock on? Yeah. Lock on target. 
Blast him! Oh, shit. Oh, no, lightning strike failure. Whoa, what the hell was that? Was that a lightning strike? Uh, it might have been. Whoa, what the shit? What? What's he doing? Oh, damn. Well, he's got a different type of gun. Oh, yeah. How do we do that? How do we do that? Oh, so you can you can focus on individual subsystems. Nice. That's cool. Critical damage to the enemy ships. <laughs> you big dumb dummy. Look at it. It's got shit coming off of it. Ruining your church. Ruining it. Fuck your gothic looking ship. That's right. Damn, he's he's got a lot of goddamn hit points. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know. See, most of our guys seem like they're all right, though. He like he went after that little firestorm ship uh, instead of like dealing with my two big old gothic cruiser motherfuckers. True. True. Turret destroyed. Ha 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 ha. Oh wait, let's take out his turrets next. Turrets. Wait, or what? No, take out his engines. Yeah. Fuck his engines. Wait, what's this? What's this one? Deck. Chances of critical damage to decks. This is a battle we cannot win. I'm taking my ship out of this mess. Oh. Admiral, he is activating his warp engines and preparing to disengage from the battle. Son of a bar guy? Cowardice cannot be tolerated. Admiral, we must put an end to this pitiful Wait, display. Wait, our guy? Or this guy? This, fool. this guy? No, I think. Oh, shit. Hi, my other? This is Lieutenant Kraft. We've executed the captain and taken back control of the ship. Good Lord. <laughs> You've been promoted to captain. Follow my orders and we'll get through this. Why was he? Why? Oh shit! Oh shit! He sent boarding guys onto my ship. Wait, what is this thing? Shoot to shoot the torpedoes, man the torpedoes. Or don't? Or wait? Or did I just shoot him off into space over here? Yeah, I think you just shot him off into space. Oh man, there's so many things happening at the same time, John. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you, man. Uh, uh, just keep firing. Fire the guns. Fire them. What's this? Is he uh, surrendering? I think he's no. I think he's like uh, hiding because he's in the the fog. Nah, we got him. What is this? Uh, medium priority. Oh, okay, so you can set a priority. Blow the crap out of him. Here, I don't care. Just shoot everything at the same time. And do the lock on again. Lock on target. That was weird. Why would our guy? Why would he mutiny, man? Well, because like, the other ship was destroyed. Yeah, but that was a garbage ship. That was like forty-one, and ours are are huge and. I think it was because of the fact that, uh, uh, that, like, the game is trying to tell you that that can happen. Yeah, yeah. No, obviously. It's just, it was kind of like, it was one of those things where we're obviously just winning the shit out of this battle. And then he's like, I can't take it anymore. I got to get out of here. <laughs> well, his ship did take a lot of damage. Let's see. Can I, uh, oh, shit. Oh, do you do it? Do it. Can you do it? Yeah, get some of my guys over there. Boom. The enemy ship has activated its warp engines and is attempting to disengage. Uh-oh. Uh, uh I have a strike team of Navy armsmen ready to sabotage the enemy's warp engine. Yeah. We must act quickly. Do it. Use the ship's teleportarium to launch the attack. What's a teleportarium? What's a teleportarium, John? I don't know. Uh, select but this ship. It's it's telling you. Do this. Perform a lightning strike. There. Oh, your faith in the emperor is as false as your courage. Dude, the emperor is rad, all right? Fire all weapons. You board board more guys. Oh, you're not you aren't close enough. Yeah. Yes, Admiral. Shoot them melted torpedoes and do broadsides. Hell yeah, man. I love this game. This is cool. <laughs> there are a lot of uh, great little indie Steam games this week. Or not indie. It's but just, you know, not AAA. Yeah, not not like big tentpole titles. Um, I took them up. What we got here? Oh, Boarding. Yay! Valor this day. Damn right! Proven yourselves worthy of the Imperial Navy. Yeah, Imperial Navy for life. What's up? Set course to leave the system. Oh, I can see how this would be. Wasn't there an option on the on the main screen for the to play this in uh, multiplayer? Yeah. I could see how this would be like like pretty cool in multiplayer. Yeah. Also, I could see how I would never be able to play this game in multiplayer because yeah. uh, people would be way too good at it. All right. Uh. Wait, isn't this my... Wait, which one of these is my ship? The honor of the... I think the they're both the your ship. The Imperious Entity. Why do I have the big, fat... The I don't know. Frog-looking motherfucker. All right. So, cool. All right. I, I'm i I'm liking... Oh, man, there's going to be orc ships, aren't there? My expectations, Admiral. Okay. However, 
Other seditious forces are making themselves known in the Gothic sector. I would like you to meet Fabricate. Orcs, 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 come on, orcs. He is in charge Ooh, of the orcs. Mechanicus shipyards at Port Moor. Admiral, you and your fleet can repair and upgrade your vessels at Port Moor. Okay. By the Omnissiah, my tech priest. The Omnissiah? That is an awesome word. Your current rank allows you access to the most common classes of vessel. As you grow in renown throughout the Gothic sector, larger classifications of ships will become available. Okay. Follow me, Admiral Spire. I wish to show you the sacred shipyards of Port Maw. Cool. All right. What's at Port Maw? Orc ships are really weak from afar. The closer they get, the better. Oh, that sounds about right. Uh, all right, you've unlocked a new cruiser slot, and you have won an additional deployment per turn. Port Moor is the largest and most sophisticated harbor in the Segmentum. Here, what the hell is a Segmentum? I don't know. Again, I don't understand a lot of the crazy moon language okay. that's going on in this game. Follow me, Admiral, and I will lead you to the docking bay. It is time to show you what my shipyard can provide. To meet the needs of your fleet. All right, show me. Light this cruiser. Displays the statistics of an individual vessel. Using this interface, you can see your ship's standard characteristics. Hull integrity, shield ship speed, ship rotation, weapons. Prowl lance. Double macro turret. In order to better understand your ship's capabilities, this panel displays the general attributes of your ship. Okay. Select the crew management panel to see more. Damn, look at all these menus, man. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of menus. Admiral, this is the crew of your ship. Okay. Every vessel has a Who's this guy? Frankenstein. And a specific set of crew. By focusing your attention on an individual crew member, the crew can improve their skills and benefit your ship in many different ways. Does that mean I won't have to shoot him in the face? Maybe. A promotion. This grants you access to better quality crew. You should start by improving the skills of your navigator. He will then be better able to guide your ship through the tides of the war. Okay. Navigator. Plus one navigator. Reconditioning will reset your crew abilities. Okay, so respec. Now, take a look at the ship's upgrades. You can install a new module on the light cruiser. All right, upgrades. Different Boom. systems on each ship can be improved with modules. Dude, look at all the things that I can put on this ship. This is like Jeff porn. Ah! I, I, I'm offended that there's a specific type of pornography that's just for Jeff that involves only menus. I like all sorts of pornography, John. But mostly menus. I do like me some menus, though. <laughs> what he likes like? big menus and he cannot lie. You uh, almost can't deny. Like a like a like a sexy girl like on like just over the shoulder like playing this game on this screen or like a Dark Souls like putting points into like dexterity. I'm just like, "Ooh, yeah, baby. Put more points into intelligence. That's hot." That's weird. different aspects of the ship. These aspects Seriously, is this damage? Is it like the British way to spell maneuver? Is it, all it does, it, all it does, it, it, uh, the only it's like aluminium, al al aluminium. All right. I mean, that doesn't sound like a real cool thing to do, though, right? Overload the shields. All right. Um, supercharged void shield. The vo uh, supercharged void shield becomes impenetrable for ten seconds. Okay. Fit. Cost twenty five. How much? Oh, it's renowned. Okay. My communion with the machine spirits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Admiral, you should return to the sector map for your next assignment. Okay. All right. Let's go. Man, it would have been so easy for them to put this game out without this level of hand holding explanation, and I would have been lost. I'm still lost. Yeah. The Gothic sector against these invaders, and you play a key role, Admiral. All right. I will contact this guy seems trustworthy. I feel like where he's going to be our best friend. I think he's going to kill us. Wait, what am I supposed to do? Oh, end turn. Enter, end your turn. Okay. Oh, and it's got that whole like risk thing. Man, okay, so when uh, uh, Warhammer 40K, like the RTS, the first one came yeah. out. Um, Yay! Orcs! Orcs, orcs, orcs! Um, your orders are to escort an important imperial convoy. Oh no, not escort duty. Fuck that. Let's eradicate this some orcs. Suffering from the predations of the pirates. 
and millions will uh, starve. I literally so there was a there was a time when they made like a risk map, yeah. right? Where you would like go around and depending on what you had on that, it would determine what kind of like thing. I had to uninstall that game. I was like started to fail the classes that I was taking that semester because I was like I cannot I cannot play this anymore. Uh, okay, they will fight to take plants from you. Be aware, the system is uh, the system under their control will give you penalties depending on the game. Blah 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 blah. Okay, let's just fucking we're we're almost we're pretty much out of time here. We gotta go fight some goddamn orcs. So, orcs. The supply convoy is awaiting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking, I don't, I just, just, I don't care. I'm, we're gonna, we're not even gonna be able to get through the entire thing. So, uh oh. Orcs. Uh, oh, okay. Shanties. Yep. Space rats? Oh no, space goblins. They're just shooting goblins out of their... Yeah. <laughs> Orcs are so stupid. I love them. So can goblins breathe in space? I don't know. They probably don't care. Or is it just that they're all dead and they're just shoving dead bodies in there? No, I think it, 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 well, it could go a third way, which is that orcs are stupid and they don't care what happens to goblins. Oh, okay. Like, what, look at this guy. He's humping that. What even? Like a wrench? Ah! Orcs are so funny. Their ships rushing headlong towards their target, guns firing wildly as they come. Ah. They cannot be bargained with. Oh, look, they're like they Soviet orcs. Ah. That they will inevitably turn against those who try to bribe them. Orcs have a need for speed. Oh, do their they feel the need? <laughs> a plethora of thrusters, boosters, and extra drives, usually all wired up to a prominent red button in the cockpit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, they're so dumb. I love them. Like the uh, orcs all paint their their they paint everything red because they think red makes it go faster. Yeah. Like, I assume the checkers is also to help it go faster. Yep. Oh shit! Oh no! Look out! Look out! Go! Damn! Wait, was that a, was that a ship or a? Rock or a planet or I have no, I think it was a ship. Experience have I learned that underestimating the green skins. But there's a whole a fast route to the grave. There's a whole there's a whole uh like I don't I it's been a while, so if this is wrong, like forgive me, the internet. But like there was a whole thing that I read one time where it was like um like orc technology I use in quotation marks doesn't actually work. That it's like the orcs all generate like a low-level psychic field that forces like their guns and to fire and their ships to run and stuff like that. Yeah. That they're like, they don't actually build technology. They just put a bunch of junk together and then they're using psychic abilities they don't even know that they have in order to make that stuff actually do a thing. Uh, which I'm like, that's great. And I've never played a uh, a single Warhammer game ever where you actually successfully defeat a um, uh, an orc invasion. Oh, okay. Like there's just so many of them. All right, so let's see. Place your ships. Place my ship. Here's the Dauntless. Here's the Dauntless. Other uh, Dauntless. Here's uh, I got a sword. I got a fire st storm, and then I got three dumb transports that I have to keep alive. Um, and we're out of time, but I'm gonna start anyway. Many enemy ships are converging on the convoy. Where are the enemy ships? These must be the orc pirates. Where are the enemy ships? Greenskins don't understand strategy. The orc ships are likely to close in at short range and rely on their tough uh -oh. front armor. The orcs are also eager to fight. These savages will try to board our ships, and they won't hesitate to ram anything in their way. Okay. Uh -oh. All ships. Prepare for battle. Okay, I'm going to tell you right now that we're not going to be able to even see the end of this, so I'm just going to go, like, balls to the wall and try to to just get as much action as humanly possible. All right. Do I have a, a probe? Where's the probe that we had before? It was, was a different on, ship. This one? The probe? Um, <clears throat> so, hey, folks, if you're watching this on YouTube, hit the like and subscribe button. Uh, if you'd like to see these videos a day earlier, you can always head on over to RageSelect.com. Um, transport ships escaped. Where do I have to take them to escape? I should have been paying more attention. Um, 
if you would like to buy this game, uh, there's probably going to be some Amazon links. What the fuck is that? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, yeah, shit. Get, get it. Is that it? Yeah. Attack it. Attack. Everybody just... Everybody attack at the same time. Ouch. Oh, there's some mines over there. Fuck. This guy got hurt. I don't even know how. Probably ran into something. Um... If you want to, uh, so if you want to buy a thing off of Amazon, whether it's uh, like, you know, a Warhammer 40K figure or like some red paint to make your car go faster. Yeah. Uh, oh, shit. Here he comes. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, John. Oh, John. Oh, John. Oh, oh. ouchie, 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 ouchie. Uh, use our Amazon links and we get a little bit of extra oh, when you do that. So I would appreciate it if you would uh, do that. If you would like to help us out a little bit more you can always head on over to patreon.com forward slash rage select and uh you can basically kick us some bucks and in return we're gonna kick you bonus videos nobody else gets to see at all in the history of all of mankind oh shit oh they're coming after my turrets or my my, my guys over here double time um Let's see. Join us back here tomorrow for Sequential Saturday. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, Facebook, Twitter. I went over all that. I think I went over everything, John. Yeah. What else? Did I get, get everything? Yeah. Uh, oh, shit. There's another ship over here. Oh, shit. Oh, they just they snuck up on me. Oh, God. Oh, no. They're walking up. They're walking it out. Oh, man. Barely. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh, crap. Okay. Well, this has been Battlefleet Gothic Armada. Hide in the cloud, you transports. You get the shit out of here. Oh, one of the transports got destroyed. Oh, damn it. Oh, uh, not the Ox. the convoy ships has been destroyed. If we lose any more, the planet we're trying to save is as good as dead. Ah, crap. All right, well. Look what you did, Jeff. I, yeah, I kind of expected that to happen, but at least we got to see. Uh, wait. Oh, oh, the the orcs have an insubordinate captain. Quick, hit them. Hit them with. Uh oh, what happened? Did we just full on lose? Yeah, I think he did. Oh, all right. Well, that's as good as a good time of the day to stop. Thanks, everybody, so much for watching. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Later.